everyone welcome back to my channel in today's video I'm going to be doing a contouring tutorial and it's a palette that's £1.99 from Home Bargains this is the palette so you've got a few quite a few different colours there you've got um, four light colours and four dark colours to contour with so I normally wear Estee Lauder double wear in shade Ecru um, and that's just a neutral shade but um, I find it lasts quite well um, throughout the day so I've just got a light layer of that on at the moment I've done my eyebrows I've got some lashes on so now I'm just going to show you how I would contour with this cream palette I quite like experimenting with them um, high-end and cheap cheaper makeup products so I'll just show you what I'm going to do. I've just got to look in a mirror as well. So I'll start with the light colours. So I'll mix in the pinky colour. There's a pinky light colour and a yellow toned light colour. So I'm going to mix the two. I'm just going under my eye. <laughs> it's a good look. So I just put a bit on my forehead, a bit down the centre of your nose. I mean, I put quite quite a bit there, but you don't have to. You just can just do your cheekbones. Um, but this is actually a, a concealer as well. And just do some just above your jawline, and then just a little bit above your top lip and now I'm just going to apply the darker tones and I've used these two which are a bit um, lighter I think there's a darker one there um, but they are really creamy actually they're quite nice to work with which is surprising for the price on your nose just on the side either side of the light the highlight and it doesn't have to be really neat either because you're just going to blend all that in soon Techniques brush and it's an eyeshadow brush because it's smaller I find it's easier to contour with and then I just do a little bit on my neck right it's looking crazy <laughs> Right, I'm going to blend it all in now. I'm using another Real Techniques brush. It's just a bit fluffier. So I'm going to start with the light. foundation 
as well to blend this in so um because sometimes it can look a bit gray looking with the the lighter shades a ring light like most people would use for YouTube videos because I like to see although I've got a light on because it's quite dark today it's been raining but I like to see I don't know about you but I like to see videos that are quite real and you can see what the products actually look like on your skin properly and I will show you in daylight what this looks like as well in the window. Make sure it's all blended on your neck as well. There's nothing worse than having a different coloured neck <laughs> to your face. Blends really nice actually. Also, I forgot the brow bone. So I'll just put a little bit underneath the brow area, blend that in with my finger a little bit. It does come with um, a shimmer shade, but it's quite see through. But I will pop that on now. And also I go over with the contour with a powder bronzer as well. I'm using a NYX one in the shade medium. So I'll just put a little bit of that, not much, just a little bit. Sets it in a bit. Make some great faces doing makeup. <laughs> um, I would set this normally with a translucent powder, just under my eyes mainly, because that's where it creases most. my chin. <laughs> I'm just popping on some blusher and it's a Charlotte Tilbury one and it's cheek to cheek swish and pop blusher in ecstasy. So that's the finished look and this is in natural daylight now. I've gone to the window just to show you what it what the contouring actually looks like. If you can see, I hope you can see. I've just popped some NYX lipstick on as well. There we go. I really like it. I mean, for one ninety nine, you can't go wrong. I hope you like this video. If you did, I'd love you to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you next